Hi, my name is Jeremy. I work for Southern Health as a community mental health support worker and I'm currently studying on the registered nursing degree apprenticeship scheme. I'm in my second year of the course and I'm aiming to qualify in roughly two years time. Southern Health has supported me through the salary programme and it's a really great opportunity. I've just arrived at work, so come and spend the day with me as a mental health support worker. Today I'm in charge of the clinic here at Avalon House, which means that throughout the course of the day, I'll see between 10 and 15 patients for a variety of reasons, such as blood tests, physical health checks, and medication administration. I'm about to see a patient for a monthly blood check and the appointment will take around 15 minutes and I'll catch up with you once it's done. I've just finished up with the patient and the bloods are all fine. Now I've just got to go and complete their notes and then it's time to go out on a community visit. But first, it's time for a coffee break. So whilst I'm having my coffee, I just wanted to chat about what we do here. Essentially, as a team, we work with patients with severe and enduring mental illnesses to keep them well in the community. This can be through a range of interventions, psychiatric, psychological, and working with other agencies to name a few. I'm gonna finish my coffee and then I'm gonna hit the road. So I've just arrived at my next patient's house. If I wasn't in clinic all day, I'd usually see roughly four to five patients out in the community. This patient has recently been discharged from hospital, so I'm just checking in on them and their well-being and finding out how they're getting on. So I'm now back at the office after my last visit, uh, just to check in with my colleagues, let them know any actions needed for tomorrow, and also to let them know I'm safe.